Sup guys, how's it going? My name is Boost and welcome to today's video. Today we have some of the brand new, and by brand new, I mean like insanely brand new. This is the first time I've ever seen these in my life. I mean like first as in I've never ever seen these covered on Instagram before. So these might be the first time anyone has found them in a store before. But these are the 2019 Mystery Models Lot Number 2 as it says right there. We have some very, very nice cars in the set. Unluckily, I only grabbed three packs. As you can see here, we have the one, two, three at the back. So anyway, guys, without further ado, let us get right onto opening this first pack. All right, opening the first one, what have we got? Okay, first up, of course, we have to start off with a sticker. This is the first Mystery Models car I've opened in quite a while, so I'm glad to see they're still doing the sticker stuff. Might have to find somewhere to put this maybe on this little the DVD holder thingy here, I only just got this today as well, a nice little addition, so anyways, the 12 Ford Fiesta on this sticker here, I'm hopefully guessing that this is going to be what is inside, let's pop the sticker up here, and oh, have we also got something else to look at other than the car here, what do we got, I'm guessing this is going to be a little checklist of all the stuff you can get, so we'll go through this just quickly first, we have the sticker sheet here, but... For this set, what can we find? The Lamborghini Hurricane Super Trofeo, the Dodge Viper SRT, the Acura NSX, is that Circle Trucker, the Cadillac LMP, the BMW M3 GT2, the Ford GT Plymouth Superbird, the 2010 Chevy Impala, the 2012 Ford Fiesta, the Datsun 240Z, and last up we have the Indy 500 Oval, so you can guess. So as you can tell, this is a very big racing theme for this mystery model set, pretty cool. But I'll pop this little thing right up here and let's have a look at the car at hand. Okay, so here we have it folks, the beautiful Ford Fiesta. I'm a very big fan of this car and a really big fan of the Hot Wheels model, so of course I had to get it. If you didn't know as well, you can actually tell what car you're going to get in the pack. You can see if you lift up, up this little tab here, you can see the Hot Wheels number, you can barely read it there, but it does say number 10, H07, or is that H or M? I think that's, is that M? Yeah, M07, that's the base code. We can see 10 there, that is the number of the car, which is this Ford here. So I purposely made sure to grab a number 10, and we have this beautiful piece here. With interesting yellow wheels, I really wish they went for a different wheel color, honestly, but the tampers on this car are very, very nice, so those definitely make up for it. Got some Toyo tire sponsors with the Hot Wheels logo on the side. Quite an array of colors going on on this vehicle. Unfortunately, no detail on the back, but I don't think they've ever gone with high detail on the mystery model stuff. A lot of cool tempos on this car, and overall looks very, very nice. Especially liking the Toyo tires window decal as well. Very, very cool. Alright, uh, we pop this to the back here. Let us pull another mystery models pack to the front. And here we have it cracked open. Let's pull the sticker out first. What have we got? Okay, yes, of course I had to get my hands on one of these Darts and 240Zs. I know people would have been angry at me if I didn't show it off in the video. So, here we have it in a beautiful red. Probably going to put this on this little DVD holder thing. I have no idea what to call it, but I'm going to chuck it on there later on. If we have a look in the bag, I'm guessing we have the same checklist here. Yep, we'll put that on top as well. And we will pull the beautiful car out. So here we have it in a really, really nice looking dark red with those golden chrome Japanese five spoke wheels, I'm fairly sure. Looks very, very clean and nice. The tempo's on the side, what do they read? We got not much going on, but it does say just the number 11 and racing and the Hot Wheels logo at the bottom right there, as well as 240Z being tampered there. On the back corner we do have some tampos as well, I can't read them on the camera because it's too small bit, but I'll be able to see after this video is edited and put together. So obviously you'll have better eyes than me right now. On the back we don't have any detail apart from the two exhausts that come out the back. And on the opposite side is pretty much the same stuff going on and it does look very nice. We have a Datsun written on the hood and some pretty funky stripes as well. And a pretty cool detail as well, 240Z going along the roof. A very, very nice looking model. And we got the final mystery model pack here. Let us try and get this open. Okay, I had to end up biting into this one with my teeth because it was stupidly hard to try and crack open. And yes, I'm sorry everyone, you might call me a scalper, but I did end up picking up a second Datsun 240Z. And also I want to mention before, I did end up getting these from, I'm guessing, not many of you people would have heard of this store, but it is Audi Supermarket. It's a supermarket here in Australia. They have a bunch of discount food and whatnot. 
and I ended up picking up these cars here. It was really random. They've had mystery models before, but I've seen this set never in my life, so I decided to pick them up. And I didn't actually realize the Datsun 240Z was in the set until I saw it at the stores, which is pretty cool. And unlike many stores that sell these, these were actually $2, which is the price of a regular retail Hot Wheels car here. Normally they sell for free Australian dollars, which sort of puts me off buying them, but for this price, it is pretty good. And also, don't worry, they normally have two of each car per case, so... I didn't buy the only Datsun 240Zs in the entire store, because they had at least four cases of this stuff. If you want to have a pit little picture story, I was at the checkouts, there was a box of these mystery models and because they don't have self-serve, I was just trying to go through this stuff as quickly as I could because I had to pull each single Hot Wheels out of the, out of the little case thing, check the number and then chuck it on the little, uh, what do you call it, I forgot what you call it, but the... I don't know, the checkout lane, the, the um, s s what is it, the store person, they automatically move it, I was just rushing myself to try and find whatever I could. Honestly, if I took my time, I probably would have grabbed the Beamer as well, that looks really nice, and it might have a plastic wing too, I'm not too sure. But anyway guys, that is all for today's video, obviously not going to take a proper look at the Datsun 240Z again, because, well, it's the same car, but anyway guys, if you did enjoy today's video, be sure to give a big thumbs up of course tell me what your favorite car is out of the set what are you looking forward to trying to find and also please let me know if you've seen these cars before i'm really interested to know if i'm the first one or not and of course as always guys i'll see you all next time